Because of this alternate picking with a pull-off in between, you're actually going to get three notes when you're only hitting the string twice. This first set of four is what you want to get down first, and it's going to be played through four times. We have second fret, pulled off to open, and then open played again. Third fret, pulled off to open, and played again. Fifth fret, pulled off to open, played again. And third fret again, pulled off to open, and open played again. On the very left top, the first notes that you're playing, if you look above, we have a down pick and an up pick. You're going to go down on the note that you play, pull off, and then an up stroke on the open note. And that's going to be played on all of these notes. So to get the idea down, just come to first string, second fret. We're just going to work on that note for a second. So we're going to be there. We're on the note that we want to play. Then with our pick, we're going to have a down stroke. Then you're going to pull off the note followed by an upstroke. Try that a few times. It's going to do that on 2nd fret, 3rd fret, 5th fret, and 3rd fret again. And it's going to do that four times through. Then on your bottom line, we're going to go up the entire scale. We're going to go from 2nd fret, 3rd fret, 5th fret, 7th fret, 9th fret, 11th fret, and then ending with a vibrato on 12th fret. These are all going to be played the same way that the first line was. Once you get done with that and you have that vibrato on 12th fret, you're going to go backwards through the scale again, ending on an E chord. So you'll do the same thing on 12th fret, 11th, 9th, 7th, 5th, 3rd, 2nd, and then play an E major chord. Third, fifth, seventh, ninth, eleventh, and end with a vibrato on 12th fret. Backwards would look like this, 12th, 11th, 9th, 7th, 5th, 3rd, 2nd, and then your E chord. <laughs> 